in that uh, victory over Kerry FC and did well down the left flank. Uh, put that ball through for Edigan, who was also a substitute in that game. Waterford FC on the attack here. Good play by them. Good save by the keeper, but he can't get a hand to it. Corey Chambers, it goes over his head and into the net. And something of a farce there, Tommy Lynch, for that opening goal for uh, Waterford FC. He's really rating it. It's been a torrid time for Robbie Lynch so far in the game. <gasps> and he gets in the challenge, and immediately... The referee, Kevin O'Sullivan, points to the spot. Now looking for his sixth of the season and buries it despite the fact that Corey Chambers guesses right and dives to his left. Conor Barry's only beginning to find his feet. He was outstanding a couple of games ago. And uh, there's certainly a football player in there. He just needs to get some game time and a bit of consistency. Well, this looks like a spot kick. It does. Dive. It's a dive. And uh, season. And he's second from the spot tonight here at the Marcus Field. Up he comes right-footed. And saved by Chambers. Brilliant save by Chambers. Or McDonald it was with Nwankwa there. Full-blooded challenge. True ball now for Success Edigan to chase down. He gets a touch to it. And he scores. What a goal by Success Edigan. Treating United back in the contest. McMenemy who was on loan with Longford last season. Shamrock Rovers player. Good defending there by Killian Cantwell, but it falls again for 3D United and Ludden can get something going. Here's Edigan again. Edigan fancies a shot and lets fly. 2 2 at the Marcus Field. What a strike by Success Edigan on the left hand side, taking the ball for Mark Ludden. And Success Edigan, when he gets goals, Tommy, he gets good goals, and that was a good goal.